to iHome TV. My name is Anne. Uh, in today's video, as you can see, I was having fun with this rocking chair. And as you've seen from the title, we will be doing a video about uh, a rocking chair. So if you want to know what a rocking chair is, if you have it in your house, I want to tell you some tips when you want to buy it and how you can maintain it. Uh, behind the camera is a very awesome, amazing person called Alex. Say hi. Hi, guys. Yeah. So he will be the one to be helping me with some of these tips. Um, so keep tuned, make sure subscribe, comment, like, and share. So let's get straight into the video. So Alex, I want to buy this uh, rocking recliner chair. As you said, it's a rocking recliner. Why is it a rocking recliner? Let's start from there. Uh, it's one of the most uh, beautiful seats that people like mm -hmm. because of the word rocking. Yeah. But the biggest advantage of it, a rocking seat facilitates it to move around. You can move around. You can even swing with it just the way you are doing. You know, so you are you swinging. Just put your, your leg like this. Yeah, you put your legs yeah. and you can just turn around. It facilitates that. Yeah, just like that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, what are the advantages of the, a rocking chair? Uh, the advantage of a rocking chair, perhaps you are from job and you are a little bit tired. Yeah. You can swing. You can just, you know, relax oh. by swinging. Yeah. That's the biggest advantage. You can even sleep on it by, you know, reclining so that you can, yeah. Can you try to recline? Of course, yes, you can do that. Here, right there. Yeah. So, actually, I feel very, I feel very comfortable. <laughs> uh, you can sleep on it. Yeah, you can sleep yeah. on it. Yeah, it's a nice it's very seat. Very relaxing. Yeah. And to uh, bring the mini back, you just put some force. And then yeah. That's it, yeah. Right? That shows of how uh, the quality of it is mm. a good one because you cannot just return with a little bang. No, you just have to return it carefully. Just, uh, yeah. Yeah. The um, biggest advantage, uh, probably, if you would please try to turn around so that they will see. I do a 360. Yeah, do a 360 because that's the advantage of a rocking. You want to talk to someone behind you, you don't need to do this. Yeah, you don't need to turn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You just turn, yeah, yeah. Okay, I yeah. agree. All right, so, um, why would someone need a, a, a rocking chair in their house? So, I think that's answered. Um, the second question is now I don't have a rocking chair in my house and I want to buy one for my home furniture, right? Yeah, so what are some of the qualities I have to look for? Because I've seen this one is uh, uh, made from um. There's this mechanism that allows it to, to rock. Yeah. What is that mechanism? Uh, it's actually inside because it's a mechanism of reclining. That's the secret of a recliner. Okay. And also it's a secret for a rocking seat mm -hmm. because you see you are swinging very comfortably. Yeah, very, very comfortable. And uh, the other thing that people would uh, prefer for a rocking chair, mm -hmm. I think it's more comfortable okay. than the other single which does not rock. Yeah. That's the biggest, biggest advantage of it. Okay. Yeah. So I suppose someone might need to, uh, for, the, for maintenance, someone might need to put oil or to lubricate the moving parts of it. Uh, yes, yes, it's a nice question. You can lubricate, especially if you want to maintain a rocking seat. Okay. Uh, that's it. But it's very easy because the way it has been made, mm -hmm. it's not such like a electrical mechanical oh. or very big mechanical, like a vehicle that you have to lubricate frequently. Yeah, yeah. But of course, maybe once in a while. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so you don't really need, it doesn't really need a lot of maintenance. Yeah, it, you it doesn't need a huge maintenance. Yeah. But uh, what I know is that uh, for a period of serving a seat, mm -hmm. Maybe once in a lifetime, because I haven't seen a situation where by a recliner, mm -hmm. especially a rocking one, okay. you can open so that you lubricate. But it, it happens just once in a lifetime. Um, yeah. So I think uh, recliner sofas, rocking, they are different. So this one I'm sitting on is a leather one. Yes. So I think there's a, a fabric, fabric what else? a microfiber. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so they are different as well. Yes. So someone should consider also noise in the um, rocking chair, so that when you do this, there's no noise that is coming from the metal. That is uh, grinding against each other too. Yes. Okay, so um, can someone buy a rocking recliner alone without a whole set? Yeah, we do. We do offer that kind of provision. Okay. Yes. Okay. But the other important one that you can also tell them is that, you know, we have a rocking mm -hmm. that is manual, like this one is manual. This is manual. And we also, yeah, we also have electrical that you can just switch. Oh. Yeah, but it's out of stock. Okay. Yeah. So I think in that case, for the electrical one, you just sit and just allow allow it to rock on itself. Yes, you have a manual. You can also have a remote where you can control. Any other questions, guys, that you might have, please comment down below in the comment section. Make sure to subscribe, comment, like, and share. I'll let you tell them. Uh, we'll see them in our next video. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Cheers.